called Nerd Dogs, and I'm going to show you how to make a miniature pool for your select dogs. And this is part of a little mini series that I'm doing where I'm making stuff to refurnish a little dollhouse. So if you like videos like this, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you like my videos and you like me because that just makes my day. And if you have any video suggestions or anything you'd like me to make, make sure to comment that down below. Okay, let's get right into it. So first, I'm just taking this plastic takeout box and I'm going to cut off one of the sides so it can be the bottom of my pool. After I chose my side, I decided that this is a bit too high for my taste and here's just a dog for comparison. So once you decide how high you want it to be, you can go ahead and mark that all the way around. Then you're going to want to cut all the way around on your line if you need to. Then you're going to want to cut out a piece of cardboard that's slightly bigger than the perimeter of your plastic container so that way it can be the top of the pool. Now that I have the top to my pool, I drew this dog bone shape and I'm going to cut this out. So now that I have my top of my pool cut out, I drew this little dog bone shape and then I'm going to trace this out onto the cardboard and then cut it out. Now I have this all cut out and it is obviously a little bit rough and it's you know cardboard and not waterproof so we know that it fits good on the tub and I like the height of it and everything so I'm going to line the back with some tape Then I just took some washi tape and I lined up the center of the washi tape with the edge of the pool. And once that was all the way wrapped around, I did some cuts so that way the tape could cover all of the curves in the shape of the dog bone. Now, since I have my top of my pool, I'm going to take this pool tile scrapbook paper that I found and I'm going to trace out the outside of the dog bone shape so that way I can cover up the cardboard on the top. Then I just glued this on and I'm going to hot glue it onto the container. And now that we have this done, I'm just going to use some Mod Podge over the paper so that way if it gets a little bit of water on it, it's not that big of a deal. Also you're going to want to pay attention to the edges that the paper and the washi tape meet and you're going to want to pat on lots of Mod Podge so that way it completely seals it all the way around and you can have real water in your doggy pool. So Mod Podge dries clear so you won't have to worry about it showing through or anything. While that dries, you can paint the bottom of the pool blue. Cut and glue popsicle sticks so that way they can stick on the edges of your pool. And you're done. Make sure to like this video. Comment down below if you have any suggestions for videos or if you just want to say hi. 
make sure to subscribe because that would make my day. Follow me on Instagram at Golden Oak Dogs and I'll see you in the next video.